reached the lost city of Zolos before any of the others, Byron sneaks away from the expedition in the dead of night. The Phantom picks up his trail, which leads directly into Dr. Bremer's hideout. <laughs> Now, don't waste my time being indignant. Just answer my question. Where's the Phantom? He was for the safari when I left. Does he know the way to Zolus too? Sure. Tata made him a present of the seventh key, showing the exact location of this place. Probably the Phantom and Davidson are on their way now. Martian. You and Watson stand guard outside. Chris, take Scott and Rocco and look through the tunnels. Hurry up now. Well, here's where we leave you. Okay, if you see anybody outside, come in and get us. We'll be in the catacombs. Now, look. I want to know what made you run out on the safari. I wanted to be the first to see the treasure. What you mean is that you figured to hide it before your friends could get here. All right. Didn't want to be left out in the cold. <laughs> well, you've got possibilities. Too bad you're not a mining engineer. That's what I really need. As it is, I'm afraid you know too much. Go on, get rid of them, Long. Oh, wait! I may be of use to you. You? Yes. If you need an engineer, I may be able to help you find one. Now, don't tell me Professor you... Davidson's one. Davidson? Yes. He studied mining engineering to help him solve archaeological excavation problems. Say, maybe we can talk business after all. Go on, sit down again, Baron. So Davidson studied engineering, huh? Keep your eyes peeled out here. Watch that trail. You're in the wrong territory, ain't you? Lift his guns. some slugs in the phantom and sink faster. Yeah, that's a good idea. <laughs> 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 
How do you like it down there? He's got a slug in his chest, a phantom drill over him. A phantom? Have you let him get away? He certainly didn't. Marston and I pushed him down a hidden cistern. <laughs> Get out there, quick. Look out, your lip marks. Nice work, fella. You take care of Marsh and I'll get that dog. Let's close in on him. Don't be a sap. You stay here and guard this tunnel. Now remember, I'm expecting. Hey, we sure got the phantom in a pocket. He's trapped in that dead end tunnel. I thought he'd drowned in that old cistern. He must have gotten out of that somehow, but he's a sure goner now. I'll take your word for that when I see it. And anyway, how do I know he won't get away again? I'll oh, relax, Doc. If he tries to get out, he runs smack into Long's gun barrel. All right, I'll take your word for it. Now, Byron, the sooner you get Davidson and his niece into the catacombs, the better it's going to be for you. Well, the safari can't be far away. I'll have him here before you know it. Hey, Martian. You sure you ain't taking oh. a chance trusting that guy? I am. Greed is stronger than fear in some people. Don't forget, Byron wants to get in on that treasure. <laughs> By the way, Doc, uh, where is this buried treasure? Yeah, that's what I'd like to know. We've been digging around here for a long time, and so far we've uncovered nothing but a bunch of mummies and skeletons. I know that, and personally, I think the treasure is just in Byron's mind. But why keep the professor and his niece around here? Why? Davidson's a mining engineer as well as an archaeologist. He is? Yes, and I'm sure he'll be glad to help us professionally with our excavation, as long as we hold the girl. That's what I call getting an expert chief. Now, Marson. I want you and Chris to act as a reception committee when Byron gets back here with Davidson and Miss Palmer. Treat them very nice. Show them all the sights and then lock them up in the catacombs. But why keep Byron around here? We'll disillusion him later. And get rid of Watson's body before Davidson and the girl get here. The prodigal returns. Professor, I want to tell you how sorry I am for deserting you the way I did. I'm glad the Phantom made me return. Well, why didn't he come with you? He's waiting for us there in the catacombs. Mokul, the Phantom says for you and the porters to camp here. Mokul, understand. We may camp back in jungle. Now, what? I'll show you the way, Diana. Here he comes with the old man and the girl. Yeah. Byron is the kind of a double-cross his own mother, if you paid him for it. Yeah. Come on. Here's the main cavern. You know where that is? Yeah. And there's the tunnel leading off to the right. You got it? Mm -hmm. Put your charge right there, just inside the passage to the gallery overlooking the catacombs. Well, it worked out all right. Byron's got him on the way to the catacombs now. Good. If you want me, I'll be with Drake in the gallery above the catacombs. Well, what do you think of it, Professor? It's amazing. See, Diana, 
Here is an influence strikingly similar to my arm. I suppose so. You know, there's something about this place that frightens me. Nonsense, my dear. It's just the reaction from all the excitement. I'm sure you'll feel quite differently as soon as you've seen the phantom. My, my. Maze of tunnels. Who would we go now? Eeny, meeny, miny, bo. <laughs> <laughs> The catacombs are this way. Oh, here we are. Catacombs. Only a very small portion of them, my dear. It's all inspiring. Diana, come here and look at these hieroglyphics. Interesting, isn't it? These are entirely different from either the Mayan or Egyptian. You're here. Yes, I'm glad I found you, but uh, this is even more interesting than I expected. Yes, Professor, but we have to get out of here right away. Why? What's the rush? But after all the trouble that we've gone yes, through to so get what here, about the treasure we came here to Byron, there's a question I'd like to ask you. Shut that door and bolt it. <laughs> it certainly can't get out through this door. One drink, hurry it up. Hey, listen, with this kind of stuff, I'm taking my time. What are we going to do? I'll take a look up there. I might find a way out. In the meantime, we'll take a look around here. Places like these are usually hundreds of tunnels. We have oh. high ones. Take a look around there, Professor. no way out up here. But I go back and tell them there's no way out up here. Any exit up there? No, I'm afraid not. That door through the tunnel seems the only way out of here. Then what are we going to do? Well, nothing to do but wait to see what happens. Phantom's down there with the rest of them. How about let me take a shot at him? Certainly not. Let them all find out there's another exit up here. Hurry up with that chore. I'm almost ready. Well, we'll get out of here and let Drake finish his work. And make it good. I'd like to see an ad crawl through here after the explosion. By the way, how did you find your way here? Byron showed us. He said you were in the catacombs waiting for us, so we came with him. That's a lie. I never saw him from the time he sneaked away until he came back with you now. Talk to me about me, won't help you any. Put down that gun. I'm working for a man now who isn't going to give all of Zola's treasure to a university. Get back there, you. You're a fool as well as a traitor. I tricked you into coming here. I stopped you just long enough so you couldn't get out through that door. And now I'm leaving by a tunnel which I told you wasn't there. You're crazy, I tell you. The man you're working for will kill you as soon as he's finished using you. Yes? I'd rather take my chances with him than with you. <laughs> The phantom will take care of himself.
Davidson lost out after all he went through. Will Dr. Bremer and his gang of saboteurs now gain control of the jungle? You can't afford to miss Peace in the Jungle, the final episode of The Phantom, at this theater next week. <laughs>